Hey, Bills here. I was going to make a quick rundown on just how to do the uh, cross-server transfer with ARC. Um, as some of you know, the way they describe it is kind of crappy. Uh, I wasn't a fan of it. You couldn't... You, if you do it their way, to me, it seems like you're only going to have... You could have three servers, two servers, whatever, but they're all going to share the same config. And after playing around with it, I got it to work sharing the same config, but then... You know, and then another user of ASM uh, mentioned uh, uh, about he was having issues and he tried another way. So, uh, let's see if I can find his, uh, his post here so I can credit him. This guy here, Kodingas, Kodingas, Kodingas. He mentioned about sim linking, which I didn't even think about, but... Uh, makes a lot of sense why not if that's all it's sharing is that one clusters folder then you know okay let's you know let's show you how to do this easily or a lot easier than that uh the links for everything i'm using is in this the description where i'll put the the video in asm i mean here's the basically the rundown you can do the sim link the old-fashioned way or you can get this uh extension and uh, this tool that just makes it all GUI related and then boom. So we're going to, you know, we'll pop over here to my server. As you can see, I got three profiles loaded, the center, the new uh, DLC, Scorched Earth, and one orc to rule them all. They're in their own separate directories, blah, blah, blah. So what I did was I went, I went with my main directory, which my main, my one file that's always been running, uh, one arc to rule them all. And at the moment, it's a mess. I mean, you can see I did it their way, save one, two, three, all this crap. Well, I did, it, it was a pain in the butt. But what I found is you can take this, and now this is with the GUI tool that or the extension. I can right-click it, and now I can hit pick source link. And then I'll do source link. And then I come over to my other directories of my saved of my other servers and then I just right clicked and then uh well shit it won't let me do it because I didn't but if you right click it'll say drop I think let me see if I can do this without breaking anything since I already made it I'm going to do pick source link and then then it is drop as and then you just drop it as a symbolic link boom you do it to that one okay and then you come back over uh, copy this one again from the main server and then go to your other server if you're going to have three or two, but I have three, and you do the same thing. You just right-click and then drop as symbolic link. Now, you can only get this cluster for a folder when you uh, set up your first server uh, with the... Uh, the command lines which I put in the help topic and I'll put it in the video and then start it let it run and it'll generate this clusters folder and as you can see like I said these two are sim links of the original oops that's sorry show uh, let me find it I'm all over the place of the original which is right here see this is a normal one no little shortcut shortcut sim link sim link so once you got them sim links created, you should be good to go. You can start up all your servers. Uh, I don't know if it matters what order you start them in, but I always start with my main server, and then I start second one, and I wait for them all to boot up completely before starting another server. Um, if this, if you do it this way, you can still use all the settings. Uh, you know, as far as individual uh, PVE for one server, PVP for another server, blah blah blah, and so on. And so far, I've been playing with it for about a half hour now. I am able to transfer back and forth from servers, which I'll give you, you know, a quick little maybe uh, rundown here. See what happens now. I have noticed. Let's see if I can fall out of here without dying. I've noticed that once in a while, though, I'll crash joining another server now i don't think it's related to the way because i was crashing um the way well wildcard tells you to do it as well 
I think it might just be some bugs in the overall transfer system since it's new. Uh, and like uh, maybe we'll get the crash and maybe it'll help, uh, you know, get them to fix it faster. But it was weird because I was only I was only crashing going to um, other servers from the island. But I could come from the island or the other servers to the island no problem. Uh, like I said, I don't know what's going to happen here. This may ruin my video, but I just want to give you a rundown on, you know, you can at least see that it's functioning, uh, you know, for the most part. Uh, we'll see what happens. Watch it make an ass of me. All right, here's your thing. Go there. Look in the clusters. And now you see, here's my two other servers. Now, let's cross our fingers. Oh, I broke the sim link. Son of a... Well, I broke it playing around with that. Uh, but this one says it's still linked. Because I can't do... Well, I can join, but not with Survivor. I wonder why. I'll have to check on the settings. Well, let's just see what happens when I hit join. I don't know why it wouldn't let me bring my survivor over. But like I said, I think there's a couple of still bugs into it. Oh, see, it wants me to create a new one. And I don't want to create a new guy. I already have one over here. Uh, what's let's, let's, let's see what happens here real quick. I'm gonna try to do this the other way. Uh, my favorites. Let's join Scorched Earth. Now, hopefully I didn't, I might have deleted my profile. Um, no matter what you do, make sure you back up everything before you start doing this. With the, and Well, that goes with any new features that WildGuard likes to bring out. I mean, it's always good to have backups for everything anyway. Um, and now, okay, yeah. So far, some mods are working on the Scorched Earth. Many of you may have known that already. But uh, my favorite mod right now, the admin control menu, is definitely bugged. He knows about it. There's hundreds of people posting on it, so hopefully he'll get back into fixing that. That's probably by far like the best mod ever made for this game. I mean, I even make a couple myself, but nowhere near as great as his. Son of a... Yeah, I deleted my profile. Uh, let's, let's just... Uh, I don't want to create a new one because then I'll have to force everything. But regardless, I mean, you've seen that they were there. They showed up in the cluster, uh, and it should serve its purpose to let you do what you need to do, and you don't have to worry about them all in the same server. Sorry about the kids melting down in the background. I got four of them, and they decided to all fight. Uh, if there's any other issues or comments or questions, just leave them on the ASM board or in the YouTube video, and I'll do the best I can to help you. Thanks.